Welcome back everyone. As we continue to honor Black History Month, I am so honored to have Kevin Anderson, founding Chief Executive Officer of the Truth Project. It's really a resource for the LGBTQ plus community of color and their allies. And it's so wonderful to have you here. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for inviting me. Of course. So tell us more about the Truth Project and really just what it has to do with our community and around our country and around our world. Well, the Truth Project is a black and queer centered organization that really focuses on educating and empowering our community um, by utilizing the arts um, so that we can promote resources and um, ensure that we address things like our mental health, our sexual health, and our emotional health. So do we do a lot of work that's um, art promoted, um, and we also have other resources that are there for the community. My, my whole thought is always work with the artists, work with the community, and then bring it to them so that it feels very uh, natural, you yeah. know, and not forced. And it's also a safe place for so many people who sadly have been ostracized or targeted in ways that they never should be. But this is a place where they can actually showcase their love for art and also show people who may not be part of the community what it's all about, right? Right, yeah, so, you know, we work with the most, what I consider most marginalized, you know, and the reality is we need spaces that, um, that allow us to be free, um, to express but also to heal and recognize that amid um, all of the work that we're creating, that there's often some self-centered work that we need to do. And so the Truth Project is responsible with ensuring that along with creating that space for the artists and for the community, we also provide other resources like support circles um, and yoga. And you know, we, we really have some pillars. So our health and wellness, art and culture, education and empowerment. And so we hold those to be really dear and true to how we provide service to the community. And quickly, you also provide services for people who may not be part of the community to learn about your community. Definitely, as well, right? definitely. Allies are part of our mission. Like, you know, we understand that we have to do bridged work. Um, and so often um, I've worked with so many artists within the city, but you know, from queer artists to uh, heterosexual artists, so. Yeah. So how can people find out more information? Um, well, they can visit Truth Project, HTX, um, everything. So that's Instagram. You know, that probably is our most uh, vibrant space. So Truth Project, HTX, and then also on Facebook and also um, our website. And I just really want to share that, you know, when we think about visiting, you know, there, there's grant opportunities and, and, and resources that the community can bring um, by donating. Um, we look forward to being able to apply for grants like the current Banff grant, the mm -hmm. South Black and Art Network Fund. Um, these spaces uh, provide funding that's unrestricted and allows us to do the work without feeling the weight of what a grant means. So exactly. we receive grants and uh, we love donations. Love so, that. Yeah. Well, listen, if you want more information, you can also go to the website or go to ours as well. We'll have more for that too. So we're CW39 Houston, no wait weather and traffic. Thank you so much. Thank you. And we'll be right back.